Okay, this is for uh, DC Universe Championship between Jack Nicholson's Joker and Adam West's uh, Adam West's Batman. Look. Scorpions can hear me because the controller is a little bit away ways. Not that far away from me, but it's a little bit away from me. So if you sit here me, it's a match between Jack Nicholson's Joker and and Wes's Batman. The following champion versus champion contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the hardcore. Making his way to the ring, representing the Alliance from New York. Weighing in at 176 pounds, Clown Jack. Guys, we finally crown a new champion here tonight. That's right, the title has been vacant for long enough. One of these superstars will be going home tonight and he as comes the new champion. But technically, think about it, he does. That's the movie I go by. Jack Nicholson's the, with Batman, with uh, Michael Keaton's movie. He was Joker, was a mobster named Jack Nicholson. When Batman chased him, he fell into that hub of acid or whatever it was, became the Joker. That's the Joker's origin. So technically, the Joker does have an origin. I don't know why people want to say, and even WB wants to say he doesn't have an origin. Because technically, he gave you the origin how many years ago from Michael New Keaton's York. Batman. Weighing in at 240 pounds, Bruce Wayne. It's a big fight feel here tonight as the title is on the line. And title matches like this have a way of getting your blood flowing unlike any other match. Byron, he certainly seems to be showing more pride of late, wouldn't you say? I would, Michael, but he's got to be careful. There are more than a few whispers backstage about that pride possibly bordering on arrogance.
social media is buzzing, as it always is when this title is defended. We've got one of the most outspoken superstars on the roster in the ring right now. Yeah, Cole, he's made it very clear what his intentions are and that no one is going to stop him. They might be intentions, but only time will tell if he's a man of his word. But he'll be taking on an individual who is turning a lot of heads as of late. He's gained a level of popularity that is steadily growing week by week. And he wants to prove that the hype is legitimate. Turning the tables there! No other way to say it, guys. That looked like it hurt a lot. Oh, man! Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Ow! Foot, meat, back. He knew that was coming. Oh, my gosh! Terminating knee smash. Look at this, just unloading. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Oh, look at this. Oh, kicks. Oh, oh man. Good grief. Turn your lights out. Vicious right forearm. Oh, catapulting down on the opponent. Sure seems to be getting out of there in a hurry. A chance to get his thoughts together and regroup. Tough position to be caught in here. You have to question what kind of malintent is behind a power bomb with that much force. Driven into the barricade. He's returning fire. Holy meet the barricade. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Gotta change something up with the pin technique. Punch the next. Ooh, kick to the face. Going for a pin for the championship. Barely kicks out. Wow. Some kind of new strategy here. What a spin kick. Staggering to his feet, but he won't like what's coming next. No! Suicide dive to the outside. Cole does it better. That is the attitude of a daredevil. The ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear. Absolute reckless abandon. No quarter being given by either competitor. You have to believe this one's going to be decided by the smallest of margins. He switches it back around. Whip back into the ring. Missed timing with that 
springboard. Ripcord, Lariat. Wow, oh, what a kick. And a kick to the... Oh, gosh. Chance he was looking for. Two. What is it going to take to put him away? And now the question runs in the mind how am I going to be able to end this? title changed hands. Yeah, and we had the distinct pleasure of having the best seats in the house, gentlemen.